Hi guys, so if you clicked on this video, I'm pretty sure that you want to find out how you can upgrade the software on your Samsung Smart TV and I'm going to show you exactly how you can do that. So first of all, we have to locate the settings button on your remote or any other button that you know it's going to bring you up to the menu. Then you have to locate support using the arrow keys on the remote. For you, the menu might look different by the way, it doesn't really matter. The menu is the same even though the interface is different. So once you reach support, press the OK button. And then for me, software update is the first option. Again, for you might be the third or fourth, doesn't matter. Navigate to software update and press OK on it. Okay, before going into this one, I have to tell you that in order for you to be able to upgrade your software, if there is any new version available, you have to be connected to the internet. So make sure that your Samsung Smart TV is connected to the internet, even if you are using a wireless or a wired connection. Okay, so we have two options here. One of them is auto update, with it, which is pretty much self-explanatory. If you have this turned on, your TV is going to search for new updates by itself and it's going to install them by itself. If you have this turned off, it, uh, it's not going to do that. And the other option is update now. Uh, some of you might have this option grayed out. I'm going to show you a way in which you can repair that at the end of this video. So uh, for those of one of you, for those of you that don't have this option grayed out, if you decide to search manually for a new version, come here and click uh, OK on update now. Okay, uh, I have a USB connected to my TV, so uh, it's asking me if I want it to search for new updates inside that USB flash drive, which I obviously don't want, so I'm going to say no. And right now, it's searching for new updates on Samsung servers, servers using the internet. That's why I said it's important for your TV to be connected to the internet. Uh, also here is telling you when is the last time you performed a search for new uh, software version or when your TV searched for a new software update if you had that uh, option turned on with auto update. So it usually takes a minute or two depending of, your, of the speed of your internet connection to do this. So I'm going to pause this video right now and I'm going to get back to you as soon as it ends. Okay, so the search has now ended. Uh, it tells me that there are no new updates for you at the moment because I already have the latest version installed. So I'm going to click OK here. I also promised you that I'm going to show you how you can do this if you have the update now version grayed out. So if you have that, you just have to locate the source button on your remote. Usually it's somewhere on the upper side next to the power on and off button. And if you click on that one, again, your menu might look a little bit different here, but you have to make sure that the first option, which is usually TV, it's selected. So go to TV and then press OK on your remote. And now the option should be available also for you to click update now. So yeah, this is how you update the software on your Samsung Smart TV. I really hope this helped you. If this helped you, consider leaving a like, a comment, or even subscribing to my channel. It really helps me a lot, and I would really appreciate it if you would do that. Thank you. Bye.